Okay, today we're going to talk about how to put WordPress on your website. You're going to want to go to wordpress.org in your favorite browser, and then on the right hand side, there should be a download tab in the menu bar. You want to click on this download tab that's usually a different color, and then on the right hand side of the download page, there should be a button called Download WordPress. Click on this button, and it's going to ask you to save your file, which is a zip file. You're going, to remember, you're going to want to remember where you save this file because you're going to need to locate it later. I'm going to save it on the desktop. Once you have it saved, you're going to want to locate it, and then you're going to want to extract it from the zip file. Now, there's many different uh, extraction tools out there, uh, WinZip and WinRAR, and even ones built right into your operating system, such as Windows and Mac. So you're going to want to right-click, and you're going to want to extract your files. Okay, and the next thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to upload them to your server. You're going to need an FTP client for this, and um, the best FTP to use, in my personal opinion, is FileZilla. FileZilla is 100% free to use, and you can use it in many operating systems, including Windows, Mac, and Linux. So simply Google FileZilla, and then it's usually the first link that shows up when on the Google Results page. Click on it, and then on the left-hand side, you can go to Download, and it's also there's a big Download button on the home page. Click the one appropriate to your operating system, download and install it. The next thing you want to do is locate your FTP details from your local web host. Uh, it, your local web host will give you the information on how to set this up. Once you have your files all installed, simply connect to your web host like I have here. And then you're going to open up your WordPress folder where you extracted your files. You're going to click and select all of them and simply drag them over onto your web host. The files will upload and then you'll be ready to install. And that's it.